All right, Nicholas Johnson, thank you as always, my friend. Great to see you. Thank we you. will be reading Axios AM in just a little bit. You too can sign up for the newsletter at signup.axios.com. That does it for me on this Thursday morning. I'm Yasmin Vasugin. Morning Joe starts right now. Face coverings have become a polarizing or political issue. How can we get past that? You know, because Donald no Trump is a hypnotist. He's the best hypnotist. Contested. He's a beautiful you know, hypnotist. It should not be a political issue. It is purely a public health issue. I mean, we haven't beat it. I, I, you know, right. every, Snake man. everything people are doing, they're going to have to say, just have oh, a sandwich wear a mask. There, Slim. Are, are, are you social distancing? So I hope everybody takes it seriously because we haven't beaten this. We don't have a vaccine yet. Hopefully blah, we'll blah, have it in the year. Blah, blah, blah. We do, it seems like the doctors blah, blah, blah. are a really good aren't job you? trying to figure out how to keep people um, I'm not uh, bigoted alive against and, blacks. And I'm recovered. bigoted but, against Republicans. You know, we're not where we need to be. I don't ever want you to swear on us. I don't ever want you to swear on us. I don't ever want you to swear on us. I don't ever want you to swear on us. What? Fake news. What? Fake news. Oh, no. We can't shut down the economy again. We've got to give all the money to the rich fucks. There's plenty of money. This ain't going to the people. Of Florida Senators Rick Scott and Marco Rubio agreeing with, wait for it, Dr. Fauci. Science. I would guess also, and I'm grateful. Fake science. I'm, I am very grateful that they came out yes. and said what they said for the deniers who are still out there, the deniers that went to Palm Beach County. You've seen the this videos. This is the third wave. Forget the second wave. We passed that already. And, We're in the third and, wave, but wait till fall. And, wait till and fall. And Everybody have a, a happy New Year and a Merry Christmas. Of course, on Facebook. It's crazy. Uh, that, that masks are Everybody up the devil. Everybody get that vaccine and, going. Stat. Uh, get in the way with God's breathing. So, no, it actually, you, we are actually temples that God has created. It protects the temple from collapse. That's another that's another way to look at it. And by the way, Marco Rubio and Rick, Rick Scott. Scott and some other Republicans who can no longer look at these super spreader events that Donald Trump is forcing people to put in place in Arizona. In Tulsa. In Tulsa. In any area that kills, that will kill senior citizens. Arizona senior citizens, their lives just got a lot more complicated after the super spreader event that Donald Trump pushed in Arizona. So we could do what? So we could spread conspiracy theories about American democracy. And so he could say, I told you he was the Antichrist. Uh, I told you, na 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 na. Trump is the Antichrist. Na 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 na. Trump is the fucking comes, Antichrist. All of this People, comes with the President uh, of the United States and I'm losing my mind. His allies on Facebook, his allies on talk radio, his allies on cable news. What a continuing dope. to downplay the dangers of this virus like Larry Cudlow. He's Cudlo. beautiful. Mm. And of course, Larry Cudlow. Conway back in March. I call him Larry Cudlow. The, the, the virus was contained. Oh, yeah. It's done. And then 120,000 Americans died. And now Cudlow is once again saying that it's under control.